Hi friends, this is Maggie. I have another video for you. This one I call the dotted flowers. Um, the reason why I call that, it's another uh, technique that I learned uh, from watching a video where you actually put dots of watercolor and then with your brush, you smear the watercolor creating the petal. Um, you have to make sure that when you put your three dots or four dots, um, that you clean up your brush, make sure that it doesn't have the ink there, bring it back with water, not soaking wet, but with water so that you can smear the dot and create the petal. So you're gonna see that technique. I'm right now mixing colors. I wanna have a yellow flower, orange or pink or reddish, just, just to create different shades and colors. So I am going to place my dots here and you want to make them a little big and close to each other um, but when you're smearing the paint and creating the petal you're going to end up with some space and you'll see. So I'm cleaning the brush making sure that it's clean water and it's not soaking water, <laughs> it's not soaking and then here you go, this is still being my first petal. It doesn't have to be perfect. That's, that's the good thing about this flower. It's not a perfect flower, but it's just a beautiful, it's a very loose flower. This is from my Hobonichi. I used the same technique. Now the paper is different. It's the Riverdale, I think, paper, which wrinkles a lot, but I love using um, coloring on this paper because of the wrinkles. And it's just a different look, but it's the same technique. So every flower is going to be different, that's for sure. These are some of the drawings that I was working this week. I posted some of them. I drew her. I didn't do lines around her hair. I like that shadow as the hair. I did her, and eventually I went ahead and I create, colored her using the straw, te the straw technique. Uh, so I kind of like it. Um, and, um, and then my other drawing here. And let's go back to the painting here and I'm going to let music play so and you can watch the technique as I build these flowers. Thank you.